Hi friends, welcome to Integrately. In today's video, we will see how do we connect an app with Integrately if it is not currently supported by us. Like suppose I want to send form details from Fedir to Integrately and hypothetically speaking, Fedir is not supported by Integrately. So for that, I need to use the webhook app. Okay, let's search webhook app. Okay, and now I want to send this data to Google Sheets. Google Sheets, let's scroll down. Okay, it says when operation is performed, that's what we want. Let's click on this. Let's check. Okay, now I need to add connection. So let's add connection. Now it says that you need to look for the API documentation and search how can you uh, set up webhooks. Okay, I've done that homework on my part. So let's copy this URL. Let's go to Fedia. This is my home page. When I click here, I can see API and webhooks. Let's go to webhook. Now I'm pasting that URL. Save. This is also called my delivery endpoint. Okay. It says it will send a post request. That's done. Now that I have established the connection, I need to ensure that data is being passed from Fedia to Integrately. So for that, we need to send a test record. In this case, it will be a test form submission. So let's go to our forms. I have this form here. Let's share this form. Let's copy and open a new tab. So this is my form. Let's fill anything. Fine. Okay, suppose the suppose the email address here we have is integrately testing at gmail.com. Sign up. Okay, we have sent a test record. Let's go back to integrately. And I'll say present this connection. Let's just once refresh. And you can see it has my data collected. So that's how simple it is when you want to bring in data into integrately using an external app. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you so much for watching.